So Lisa, you say stellar pizza is a new art form. Tell us why you chose it. Um, it just raises, like I said, just raises pizza to new art. Um, the, the crust is amazingly crispy every single time. I think I've been there about 30 times a year in the past five years. So wow. it is, it's not just a pizza parlor, it's an experience. The sauce is very spicy, which I like. I like a little kick to my sauce. And it's, you, it comes with all different toppings, but I just stuck on the, um, on the E27 firefighters pizza. It's some um, uh, handcrafted salami from a local person in North Seattle. It's very thinly sliced green peppers. It's a little red pepper. It, the, the cheese is just right on it. Tim, what did you have when you went to Stellar? I was a little greedy and ordered three half pies for two people. So that was, mm -hmm. we probably took half of it home with us. We had Corson Classic, which was Yukon potatoes, Gorgonzola, various other things. When it had just this sort of right amount of crispy base, you uh -huh. could actually pick up a slice and it held its oh, being, integrity yeah, soggy, and then like enough doughiness on yeah. top and really good thick mm -hmm. slathering of ingredients on, on the top of that. It was, it was a fantastic pizza. I was pleasantly surprised by the Greek salad. Um, it was really robust. I loved the, I loved how, loved how crisp everything was. The peppers were big hearty chunks of really crisp peppers and there was a lot of olives and goat cheese and uh, red onion and there was no lettuce in the salad. I love the salad, six dollars, yeah. it's gigantic. <clears throat> I love all the bits, you know. I had the gorgonzola and pear salad and I always find when I usually go to a restaurant they give you a tiny bit of the goodies, you know, yeah. the gorgonzola and, they and, they and the, on it, yeah, yeah, they're yeah, very they generous. piled it on yeah. and it was only, it's only six bucks, it's just yeah. huh. delicious. I kind of wish I'd have that, <laughs> that sounds great. What about um, your favorite drink? Oh, Manny's, hands down, Georgetown Brewery, yeah. delicious. And they have a great beer list, actually. Mm -hmm. It's a sort yeah. of yes. fold-out beer list. Yes. has a paragraph of information about every beer. And I mean, that was terrific. That was uh, really yeah, I love the microbrews, so that's a big pull for us. Yeah. Although I'm, I always go back to Manny's. And um, you're nodding as well, Jenny Lee. So talk to us about your love of beer. Oh, I love beer. Um, <laughs> <laughs> beer is awesome. I was really happy to see there was a lot of local beers represented on their beer list. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a big fan of Georgetown Brewery, so seeing... a Good spread of what they have to offer at, at Stellar was 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 great. Lisa, you picked this, so talk to us about the neighborhood. Well, I just love it. It's just a quintessential Seattle place. Um, you know, multiple piercings, tattoos, um, <laughs> all different interesting things. You know, people to look at. Great for people watching. Um, wide variety of age groups. Um, it just feels like a second home to me, and I guess because I have been there so long, but it's just very comfortable. When I think of Georgetown, I, I think of I think of beer, I think of guys on bikes, and that really, the Stellar Pizza really kind of embodied what I think of Georgetown mm -hmm. in a really yeah, really yeah. cool kind yeah. of funky yeah. industrial oh, way. Yeah. Um, I think it, I don't know, I think it's a fun neighborhood. Yeah, I think, I mean, if you took that place and plopped it on Capitol Hill, no. It would have a totally different vibe. Yeah. You'd have yeah, a different it crowd. Work. It wouldn't have the same yeah. kind of grit. It wouldn't be as awesome. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Yeah. We always get a booth in the 21 and over side. Mm -hmm. And just, um, you know, while you're waiting, there's just so much to see and look at on the wall. I, I, still, yeah. I still see things I haven't seen before. It really feels like uh, you feel a touch of a, of a person there. I mean, it's not, exactly. it's not over designed. You, you get the sense that somebody genuinely found a bunch of things mm -hmm. yeah. over time and curated them without being too precious about it. Yeah, exactly. The side you come in on, there's a big S over the bar. The mm -hmm. bar is, is metal. They've got all kinds of funky signs from the 60s and 50s. They've got these 60s, classic 60s um, lamps on the table. Yeah. You know, the big shades. Yeah. Kind of the little, thrift store kind of, yeah, 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 thrift store yeah. buys. And um, you get the, I think it has faster service over on that side too. Yeah, so I'm was, always mm -hmm. kind of like, mm, when, when we go on the kitty side because it, uh, it was kind of disappointing for me on the yeah. on the family side, especially I walked in and there was no sign on that side saying to seat yourself and there right. wasn't a waitress to greet us. Uh -huh. <laughs> and so we stood there for three minutes trying to figure out what to do. Uh -huh. And and then I like peeked around to the other side and saw there's a sign that says seat yourself, but you can only see that from the right. 21 and yeah. over side. So yeah. I was like, oh, well. Well, I feel a little stupid now and, you know, had a seat. And as soon as we were seated, we, you know, got service pretty quickly, but uh -huh. it felt like, yeah. well, yeah. you know, families like pizza too. Lisa, you pick Stellar. Tell us why. Give us a sum up. Crispy and fresh and delicious and just quintessential Seattle experience. God. 
tons to look at, good, satisfying food, awesome crust. Again, great beer selection. And yeah, the decor is fabulous. The crust was great, but most everything else left me thinking of little improvements that could bring it from good to great. All right. Well, you can try a slice for yourself at Stellar Pizza Ale and Cocktails, 5513 Airport Way Boulevard South in Seattle. It's 206-763-1660. Open for lunch and dinner Tuesday through Sunday, and reservations are not required.